After my first game as a starter, I had created such a buzz around the league, shoe companies start throwing deals at me left and right. I mean, why not, right? I have three stepbrothers who all dominate the NBA. Why not give me a chance, right? Unlike my other brothers, I decided to go with Nike. Now let's be real. My first game as a starter in the NBA, I kind of went off. You know, I carried the team, but we'll get into that later. Lucky for me, my agent knew we had leverage simply off my name and who my family was. The negotiation process was a little unorthodox. He wanted to meet us in a barbershop, but you know what I'm saying? I will say this, it all worked out in the end. Not only did I manage to get every pair of Nikes in Foot Locker for free, but I managed to sign the biggest shoe deal Nike has ever written up. Yeah, bigger than LeBron's deal, and we all know they gave LeBron the world. Let's just say they gave your boy a world and a half. With all this money, you'd assume there weren't any problems that came along with it. Unfortunately, the saying is more money, more problems. You probably know my brother Vert, his girlfriend is missing. And ever since I got into town that night at the strip club, things have been mad weird around here. I've been staying at Vert's place since he moved out for, from all the bad memories. And it, it's pretty crazy in this town. I'm not gonna lie. I try my best to stay out of trouble, but I guess trouble has a way of finding me. With my money, you know I had to go buy me a new car, bro, a new whip. Something that really let people know who I am and who I was, you know what I'm saying? Set me apart from my brothers. Let me build a reputation for myself. Now listen, bro, this is my dream car, man. I, I do anything all right. to walk out of here with this car, man. I, I, I really okay, hope my paperwork right. well, look, right. look, everything looks good to me, nigga. Hold on, bitch, what? Ah! After I got the whip, I had to go get iced out, you know what I'm saying? Get that drip right. Get it right at all times. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Weiss Only Jewelry. Come in, and if you see anything that you like, I'm here for you. Okay, well, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be over here then. I'm gonna be over here looking at the necklaces. Okay, thank you. This bitch just really called this store Weiss Only, bro. What the hell? I don't even know if I want to be in here. Do do do. What the hell? Tuck and roll, Becky. We've done this shit before. Is, is she following me? We practice for this moment. Hold on, bro. Let me see something, bro. Make this bitch run around the whole store. Do do do. Yeah. Do do do. Do do do. <laughs> this bitch really running around the store. <laughs> oh, look at this. this um, hi. Hey. hi. <laughs> I hope you're getting along okay. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> na, 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 na. Hey, you watch this. Can I help you with anything? Okay. Is there anything okay, that you what's, are, what's up? Are you, Hello? are you following me? Please is don't that get what angry. It is? You Please think, don't get it's angry. It's because I'm black. Ah, ah, black man. man, he's angry. Man. Angry black man, help me. Man. I'm ah, not going to hurt you. Oh, my God. Are you serious? He's fucking angry. You know what? I'm just leave. Don't you walk I'm away just leave, me, okay? you black monkey man. Just let me leave. Ah. You following me outside the store? But no matter how much money I spent, it was something about that night at the strip club that really threw me off and I had to get some more info for my brother's sake. I hadn't told him about the incident or what I saw cause I wanted to be sure before I made any allegations. <laughs> Let's just say things got out of hand real quick. <laughs> The Thunder is the road team for today's Western Conference matchup. Yo, what's going on, all of my NBA 2K19 savages? This your boy YJ. Just a man, if you nasty, and uh, <laughs> don't worry about the record, okay? We 3 and 11. I get it, okay? Uh, okay, damn. <laughs> Lacrosse is here to change all that, and if you guessed if you assumed that your boy was going to the phoenix suns with your magical smartness then you are correct we are here in phoenix i gotta help deandre and i gotta help that man buckle mr d book these nuts d book these nuts yeah we gotta get these boys a ring or something green at least Ooh, we we started off just like that and if y'all remember last year that boy used to slice neither's up getting to the rim and he right. doing his thing already this gonna be a high octane real fast paced team right now bro we got a lot of young people besides jordan crawford okay but i've been struggling with the thought hold on wait a minute disrespect uh disrespectful 
Now there's going to come a time when the secondary team comes into the game, and we really don't have a power forward. As you can see, Mr. Warren there, he's not a power forward. I don't know why he's at the fourth position. So you guys let me know. Two. Oh, we. <laughs> la la, though. We're going to be throwing a lot of those to DeAndre, man. But you guys let me know, bro. I, I, I got to talk to the GM in the next episode and make some ch -ch -ch changes because we need some power forwards. So you guys give me some non-superstar. Hold on. Green. Well. You guys give me some non-superstar power forwards down. Some good role player power forwards. You know what I'm saying? Down in the comment section because I'm going to get two power forwards, bro. I'm getting rid of all these guards. I'm getting rid of all these forwards on this team. Me and the GM, we got to talk about it. Green again. We got to get these boys up out of here. You feel me? The score is 37 to 49. Putting the moves. Find Devin Booker wide open in the corner, bro. Hey, look. Look, 2K. <laughs> Square up, bro. Because y'all got Devin Booker all wrong, bro. His tendencies is all off. Mr. Warren, I I feel like you saving, you reserving your seat on this team because I will get rid of all y'all like Thanos. You feel me? I got the Infinity Stones. I'm talking to the GM in the next episode on God. Y you hear me? Oh, God. <laughs> right now, the boy got 30 perks, eight re... Oh, I was about to say reboards, but that's three reboards, eight, nine, wait a minute, nine assists. I'm trying to spread the width as much as possible, but... My team just don't want to score, bro. They run a weird, like, four out, one in lot setup, and it, 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 it's, it's, it's killing my vibe, brother. <laughs> Nobody really moves unless we're on a fast break. That's why I say, bro, it's going to be a young team. It's going to be real high octane. We're going to be moving, moving. Now, coach took me out of the game. I'm on limited minutes. 54 points to 73 points, right? What happened? <laughs> 77 to 85, and not only that, but the Oklahoma City Thunders are, they're thunderous, okay? I don't know how else to explain it. We only got a two-point lead right here. Finding TJ open again, and a one. Luckily, the only way we can get movement out here on this court is by the simple fact of the pick and roll, bro. But again, I still need power fours at this position. Look, look, what's his name, Rashawn Holmes? That's our center. That's our secondary center. Du Bois is all a six foot four IRL. Okay, help, help. 87 to 95, bro. Lacrosse said he gonna help himself. Big bat fella, do what you gotta do then. Finding that man Kelly Oubre Jr. pulling up with that yumper. He is very inconsistent. Maybe they'll get more, oh, green, oh, wee. Hold on, pal, putting us up by 10 there. But fast forward right back. Let me get that. Playing defense. I'm going all the way with my rim grazer. Hey, say it with me in the chat. Rim grazer. You got to roll every R in, or you ain't doing it right. Just start the video over. Watch all the ads again. <laughs> then get back to this point and roll it. Right here, putting the moves on that man, Dennis Schroeder. Breaking his ankles. Getting back to the rim with the rim grazer. Okay. You got it now. I'm proud of you. You graduated from the Tongue Roll Academy. 99 to 106, spinning off of that bitch. Boy, hold on, boy. When I tell you I be spitting, I be spitting. Okay, I got to clean my mic off after this. We only up by six. TJ Warren again in at the power forward. That's my... <laughs> Guys, he's my starting power forward, bruh. Why? Right here, give me any one. Toying with that boy Russell. That's... You see how long it took me to go up with the layup. I wanted to see if he was going to try to block me. I couldn't break this man's ankles for nothing. Right back with another anyone on twine. Up by nine points is that? No, that's not nine. Never mind. <laughs> I can't do math. We up 14 now, bitch. Ah. Eight three-pointers in the game. Your boy finished with a double. Double. 109 to 120. Coach took me out limited minutes again. And I am grinding offline for you guys so I can bring you the most enjoyable content. We finished the game 116 to 123. I hope you guys did enjoy this first video. Hall of Fame verification is on your screen. If you did, make sure you guys leave it a thumbs up, subscribe, turn on post notifications if you are new to the channel and you want to see some more NBA 2K19 content just like this. 
And I got you guys. And I'll catch you in my next video. Peace. Hey, man. Yeah, that's it. You feel me? Tie game in the third. I'm, I'm not going to hold y'all, bro. Playing on Hall of Fame gets very frustrating. And I know a, people, a lot of people in the comments, oh, he playing on sliders. He's not playing on Hall of Fame. Anyway, shut your dumb ass up. If